Hello, this is another tutorial video for Echo RSS Feed Post Generator plugin for WordPress. I felt that it is needed uh, another tutorial video for this plugin because it came a long way uh, since its initial release and it got quite a few updates. So if you check its original tutorial video, uh, you will see that the video lacks quite a bunch of features that the plugin actually has. So I thought that it is needed uh, updated tutorial video which will include all the new features that the plugin actually has. So uh, in this video I will not uh, give accent to uh, initial features that you can check also in the uh, initial video but only on new features. I will use the feed from TechCrunch and I will generate only one post to speed up things. Okay, so this is the new advanced settings uh, rule settings. Here you can see that you can add multiple uh, post categories to posts, to generated posts. Also you can remove categories that are preset, uh, automatically set. If you check auto post categories, then the, the plugin will automatically fetch categories from the RSS feed. With this feature you can remove uh, categories that you know of and you know that you will not want to be set to your posts. You can also remove WordPress default post category which is the uncategorized category for most of the blogs. You can remove the uncategorized from the generated posts. You can auto add tags, manual add tags. You can strip images from post content, if you check this. You can get published date from feed. This means that the post will be published with the date. Uh, so the generated post will be published with the date that were published the original uh, post from the feed. So this imports the date from the feed. You can enable comments, these were already in the also you can uh, set custom fields to the post the custom fields have this uh, syntax custom field name this arrow custom field value comma and repeat and also here you can use many many short codes as you like in the value of the custom field you can strip HTML elements by ID or from class. You can run regex on content. This is a very nice feature that was introduced recently. You c if you know regex, you can uh, enter here a regex ex expression and another one here to replace it. With this feature you can replace any uh, string or any text from generated posts or rem to remove them if you leave this blank. You can also limit article word count to a number or input a percentage of the content to keep. If, you, if the website states that it allows 25% of its content to be republished, then you can set here 25 and the plugin will post only 25% of the full article to comply with the regulations of the source page. Also, you can automatically input, import featured images. You can skip the feed image as the featured image source, so the plugin will not check the feed image. Uh, this will force the plugin to not check the OG image meta and do not check post content. Uh, also you can communicate to the plugin to not use the first image from the content if the first image is something that you don't want. Default featured image, this already was in the 
uh, initial plugin. This uh, instructs the plugin to use this image link that you insert here if the featured image is not existing on the article. Also, band word list, required word list. You can ban or require some words. And if the plugin does not meet these restrictions, it will not be imported. If the post does not meet these restrictions, it will not be imported. Also, you can translate uh, the content to any language using Google Translate. And you can select also the source language from of the original article. Uh, please select the source language of the original article correct unless uh, the translation will not work. You can uh, force to not spin posts generated by this rule. Uh, the spinning options are in the plugin's main settings and apply to all uh, rules. You can also set uh, automatically delete post rule. If you want to automatically delete the, the post, you can set here uh, in natural language. You can set plus one week or uh, yesterday or plus one year. You can set here natural language dates and the post will be deleted in one year from its publish time if you set it like this. Also, you can get the full article content from the source article. This already was in the original plugin, so I won't put accent on this feature. You can select class XPF or regex. This is not uh, required. This was required in the additional plugin. This is not no more required. You can uh, only check, try to get full article content and the plugin will recognize the, uh, uh, the article content and import it automatically. Okay. You can strip HTML from full content to leave only text. And these are some advanced features. Get only forced ML element. If you use the query type and query string, you can use this to only get inner GIF content and also get CSS and select article encoding. Okay, so let's uh, demonstrate this real quick. Import a quick article from TechCrunch with full article content not just the content that is included in the feed. Okay, and it is already done. If we go to the post, we will see that it has the full article content image and everything imported. Uh, the post also has a crawling helper page. If we go to a, a post that we want to import from and insert its link here and click crawl, you can see the post loaded here in WordPress. And if you if you hover your uh, a mouse over, you can select what you want to uh, get from the full content. So if you hover this mouse like this, you can see that it is highlighted the full article content. And if you click it, you will see element class is article entry text. So this means that if we uh, go to RSS posts and here select class and here article entry text should be pasted. So this is how the crawling helper works. This is also a new feature that wasn't in the initial plugin release. Also 
some features from the main settings. As you can see, here are also some more custom features. You can use custom simple pi instead of built in one. <coughs> use custom simple pi user agent. Uh, these are advanced simple pi options. If the feeds don't work that you want to import, please try to check these checkboxes and it might solve your issue. Also, you have post image options. Try to get featured image from content. If you uncheck this, the plugin will not check content for the featured images. You can copy images from content locally. Do not use remote images in post content. You can force the plugin to not copy featured image locally. This will uh, use the featured image of the post from the remote location. Notice that this is not compatible with all WordPress uh, themes. Only some are compatible with this feature. Uh, you can verify featured image if it's not corrupt. You can resize featured image to uh, size you want. You can re re resize iframe if iframes that are imported from the original post. <coughs> you can force the plugin to not check post in generated post tool settings. You can force the plugin to dra draft first the post and then automatically publish them. This will be helpful if you use other plugins uh, to automatically publish uh, posts to Facebook or uh, other social media. So if you use other plugins that auto publish your published posts, then this should help you because uh, there is an issue with these plugins that they don't recognize featured image if you don't check this, this checkbox. So if you have image with this kind of auto-publishing plugins that uh, don't recognize featured image of articles, please check this checkbox and it will solve you, your issue. Uh, you can replace uh, VP cron with real cron or you can set a secret word here and it will replace this secret word and you can set up a cron job from your hosting to call the uh, URL that is uh, set up here. You can change the secret word from here and this word will change. <coughs> you can enable auto deletion feature from or, de or disable it, the one I showed you in the rule settings. Uh, these are uh, old features, I won't uh, explain them. You can also search Google Archives when direct page fetching fails. So if you import full article content and the article you want to import does not exist, uh, the plugin can, uh, can check Google Archives and fetch the full article from there. This is also a great feature. Also, I have added proxy uh, support for the plugin. You can input here a proxy URL and uh, uh, in this format, IP address uh, and port. You can also input authentication for the proxy. Delay between rule running. You can input a pause for the <coughs> uh, plugin between rules. You can send email reports and force the plugin to not check duplicates. Uh, post content options. Uh, you can link generated post titles to source articles. This will not uh, link posts to their original uh, content, but instead they will be link to the source article URL. This is useful if you want to only import titles of posts. You can append media from feed enclosure to post content. If you want to add more ri uh, rich content to your posts, then you should check this. <coughs> you can disable automatic accept generation for posts. You can change the word count for excerpt. Uh, you can force the plugin to not generate inexistent categories for new posts. 
this is useful if the uh, feeds have many many categories and you don't want to import only categories that are already existent on your WordPress blog you say check this you can still feature the image from generated post content strip links from generated post content open all links in new tab add no follow to links skip javascript from crawl content uh, add some attributes to internal or external links uh, <coughs> append the string to all links from content if you want to app append a string to all links you can do it here uh, you can change the date format for item publish date shortcode uh, you can replace your all URLs from content with this URL and the read more button text these are some posting restrictions these were already in the initial release I think uh, skip post with these words in their featured image names so you can skip featured image names also from the posts skip posts that do not have images require band word list text pinning options so you can see there are some text pinning options also more will come here uh, uh, in the near future also I will add spin rewriter here in an upcoming update and these already were features also I have added list posts and display posts to list posts that are uh, generated by this plugin so these shortcodes will display posts that are imported by this plugin so as you can see this plugin has quite a lot of features and it uh, evolved quite a lot since its original initial release I hope you enjoy this plugin and give it a rating on Code Canyon if you like it. So this is all. Until next time, bye bye.